Hello, hello! I am Ashen Ninja and I'm back here again with Prince Imric. Now, we need to begin my plan for world domination. Or to survive a bit longer, because I'm not doing a good, too good a job at that. On to adventure. Now, you're a noble. What sort of noble are you? You're, oh, you're my emollient noble. That's right. I'm going to give you some more province happy making stuff, I think. Uh, we do need to try and keep our provinces happy. You're happy, you're happy. Okay, that's fine. We need more money because I'm fucking broke. But we're going to have our dragon building again soon, so that's good. That's good, good. So it's not having the bad thing. Alright, so what we're going to do is, we're going to take Ashridge Mountain. And then we're going to sack Mount Greyhag. That's the plan, anyway. See how the plan goes. They have no allies, I'm probably going to annoy some races somewhere. But that's fine. It shouldn't be too difficult a battle, but you never know. These fools have no chance. Uh, they that pretty much have no dragon. shooting. Who knows what their uh, what their uh, tower situation will be, though. The problem with sacking the city as well. I bet you it's not actually worth a lot of money to sack, because it's only level one. Our sun dragons could do with a bit more health. But that's okay. Probably should have put Imric back on his dragon, or at least a horse, but that doesn't matter either. Uh, we'll gamble that one. I gamble when it's under half, just in case Ranold is with me. Let's get everything sitting over here now. Shouldn't need any of the fire. What I should have done is put my uh, mage back on its dragon, so that she could have... Uh, done the necessary flying about the place with fire magic. That would have made a bit of sense. But that would have also mean I would have had to be smarter. And we can't have me starting to do smart things. What kind of strategist would I be then? A good one, probably. Can't have that. Move her back a bit. I don't actually want her getting shot. Let's get let Imric get shot because he's got I don't know some stuff. Uh, we'll fast forward this one as well. Battle make go faster. Pew pew. pew. All right. So Razor Dons are they're pretty good actually. I think if I remember correctly. Yeah, but they've only got a range of a hundred. Skinks only have a range of 100 as well. Let's send our mage around to somewhere where there's no uh, dudes with shooty things. And we will get her to set fire to some lizards. Which is not the best way of getting rid of a lizard if one is ever in your house, just so you know. Don't, don't go set fire, setting fire to lizards. That's just awful. Maybe if it's a snake. Especially if you're here in Australia and it's a fucking brown snake. Don't fuck with them. They're pricks. Angry, angry bastards. Who can blame them anyway? They live in Australia. You're gonna ever be angry lizard. You'd live in Australia and be an angry lizard. Oh, that went completely the wrong way. That was terrible. Got one kill from that. <laughs> oh dear. It's a good thing I can see the funny side of things, eh? Oh, well. That's okay. We'll still persevere. Plonk our next one here and see if we can get it to go down the wall. Kill some skinky boys along there. Oh, I see, that's my, that worked out. Well, not a huge amount better, but a bit better. 
Oh, and it's done some damage to the Razodons as well. That's not too bad. Did some damage. The nice, nice thing there is they've decided to go and put their troops on the wall now. So that will mean... I can't shoot at the front ones for whatever reason. I should be able to shoot at the back ones. And hit both. Which is always good. Get the bolt throwers some kills. Get them some more chevrons. Give you another crack at going down the wall now as well. Oh, I should have gone for the other side. Ah, that's doesn't matter. That's fine. Uh oh. Well, Alright. Sometimes you see the gates open and that means they're coming out to play. Alright, they put the javelins at the back for some reason. But that's okay, we'll just, you know, wreck them. That's fine. No reason we can't do that. Can we hit those spear riders? No, we can't. Oh, so I'd put more saurus up. They're not getting a lot of kills, but they're, they're doing a bit of damage. I think it's almost time to give up on my uh, magic, though. really need like big hordes and shit hanging about here for for that to work well. Oh well, let's let's get our archers doing things instead. Because they don't have a great deal of range themselves, so our archers can absolutely wreck this garrison. Meanwhile, let's finish off our magic by doing some bolts of burning instead. At the moment, I think that's that'll be the more effective of the spells as they bundle everything up on the walls. Just nicely for us. Now let's get this, these units of archers over here and we will... Uh, Wreck the big monster boy. Who's nice enough to be in range. And very susceptible to getting shot. Good big monster boy. He's shattered. You don't have to shoot him anymore. Oh, we're getting shot at by the tower. Get ourselves out of tower range. It's nice of them to blob like that for us, but you know, not entirely necessary. Come on, guys. Look, you, you, you all get your your chance to be wearing and. Lovely, lovely arrow to the face. Specially crafted by elven maidens. Uh, out of ammo. Head over there if you're out of ammo so that I know not to use you over here anymore. is in our grasp. Of course it's in our grasp. It was in our grasp from the very start. Why did you stop firing? Are you just hopeless or what? Okay, apparently. Right. Never mind. Pew, 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 pew. pew. Boop, 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 boop. There are some razor dons. Oh. Uh. To select all of them as well. Yes, 
the slaughter is real. Well, not, not 100% real. Because that, that would actually be quite disturbing. Do, 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 do. No, we're not, like, literally slaughtering people. That'll be coming up later in real life. As war breaks out in the Asia Pacific. What fun that'll be. Unfortunately, these days, it feels a lot less like I'm joking when I say that. But anyway... That's fine. It's fine. Alright, so what we need to do is I kind of need to get rid of this unit. Yeah, well, that, that works, having them move all the way over there. That's good. Yep. Thank you for coming. I'll see you in hell. Silly Saurus Warriors with shields. Now, one of the reasons you should shoot at these guys from the site is because shields only work from the front. So, if you want to maximize your kills on shielded units, that is what you need to do. Shoot them from the side or the rear. Preferably, admittedly, from the rear. Nothing wrong with a bit of rear action. Uh, we need to get more archers up. More archers, I say. So these guys are low on ammo, and we'll get them to you know, shoot these horned ones who have been nice enough to move up to here. So that we can kill many, many horned ones. I'll use up these guys' ammo. And the horned ones will be going away soon. You guys fire over there. You guys get out of the way. Alright, well there we go. That's a victory over the Lizardmen. Here. Easy peasy. Lizardmen are terrible defenders. <clears throat> like, honestly, the best thing for the Lizardmen to do would have been to sally out. But they're not going to do that because it's AI, and AI don't do things like that. Think about those horned ones and that. Uh, as you can see... They'll fly Sacking's not worth a lot of money, but it's worth the ex experience, so. Now, one thing I want to check is, is that putting me down with them? Nope. It's fine. Though apparently I'm a great power. Not something I'd suggest at the moment that I am, but if that's what they want to suggest... Now, I'm not going to actually do that upgrade. I want to do this upgrade here. Try and get as many of our money buildings up as possible. We are going to have to fight the Dark Elves soon enough. Well, as the Orcs. And it's just not going to go easily. Alright then. Lustrian Strength will fail. That's good. Uh, I think. In scouting. And that'll be the end of that turn. Lovely. Expanding our realm once more. Alright, the last offenders have gone to war with Grimgore's Ard Boys now as well, which is good. More enemies against them is good for us. Because more against them means hopefully less of them actually paying attention to me. I want to pay attention to this area. Try to get malice out of my way. Our traditions give me strength. That's good. 
Your traditions don't give me strength. Excellent. Brave son of Ulfwan. Bit more influence is handy. Uh, we're giving the gather influence one. Greatest of the dragon princes. All right. So if I move him out. What I do need to do is move him this way so that I can actually do some scouting there. Now, I don't want to actually get him too far away from our stuff yet. Let's uh, pop him into that. Let's, uh, no non-aggression pack possible currently. He's at rank 2, he's at rank 5. That's all good. That's fine. You're not gathering influence anymore. I have to get that next turn. We are going to have to hit Mount Greyhag next turn as well. I know the way. Just try. We're really trying to slow climb here. It's. Gotta get ourselves back in the action. <clears throat> and hopefully not destroyed by the orcs and stuff in the process. Oh, geez, the dwarves are just getting more powerful. They're going to be the blue tide before we know it. When we have enough influence, we might have to get them fighting against some of their own kind. Right, expires. I wonder which one that was. Probably that one. Yeah, that's how it was. I remain. We're probably not going to be doing well here with things anymore. Oh, but we've, our money making has now increased. How wonderful. Wunderbar. Still want you heading that way. We'll leave Ashridge Mountains at rank 1 for the moment. Let's head to Mount Greyhag there. Really in need of a lot more cash. Don't have enough to get influence. Cool. Alright. I don't want the gashes. Uh... We'll just continue on then, shall we? We'll have to fight to get at Mount Greyhag. It'll be a very similar battle to the one we just had, but that's okay. More fighting, more experience. I think what I did learn from that ice fight is don't really worry about Flamestorm so much. I might try using Burning Head on the on those uh, what are they called? Soros Warriors. Preferably with a. We're working. We're we're doing okay. Okay, good. I am yours for honor. Ooh, uh, you, don't, you don't have to be mine. It's fine. All right. Uh, that needs a lot more growth there. So. You may look upon it's that. We will prevail. Ah, uh, it hit Mount Greyhag. Oh, okay. This is a different garrison. Interesting. We could actually auto resolve this one, but I don't really want to. These uh, fools have no chance. Do too much damage to us, and we just don't have that kind of uh, money at the moment. Ah, oh, Ranold isn't with us this time. Rude bastard. Sometimes he's with you, sometimes he's not. What a jerk. Alright. Uh, Imrik, you'll do the usual tanky winky. Sounding weird when I say things like that. Tanky winky! Pew, 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 faster. Not 
the towers really want to shoot at her, don't they? Is he hidden or something? He is. Oh, fuck. Does he? He's got... Oh, shit. He got fucking Stork from... Snicket, didn't he? Shit balls. I don't think he's... Because he doesn't have a... Fuck, yes, he did. Ah. I need to keep it on. Fucking dragon. That uh, That's actually the annoying thing about uh, killing Snicket. Is you don't... Like, getting Stork on your Lords can be good. But when it comes to... Oh, yeah. I want to be able to bloody do this sort of shit. And actually use them as a tank. They can't see him. Just shoot at him. So... Big pain in the old bum hole, that. <clears throat> right, I don't really think magic is going to avail me much in this particular battle. Because of the way they're set out. The way the walls are. So I think the best option is... To move all of my archers up. It's not like they can shoot me anyway. And what we'll do is shoot the crap out of them. Well, we will drop some uh, fire bullets on all of this since they're all bunched up. Oh, no, I might throw a burning head through there. I didn't notice that. It's nice of them to be all grouped up like that. We'll do an overcasted burning head, because I want to see how much that damage will do, because these guys are relatively heavily armoured. So... Yeah, not really a lot of damage there. But they are still grouped up quite tightly, so... Well, two of the units are. So I might try a flame storm on them. After all. Oh, okay. They they brought some of their skinks out for some reason. Bye skinks. Yeah, they brought brought them out to stand there and stare at the wall. So work that one out. I haven't quite worked out some of these AI decisions yet. But, you know, it's, uh, as long as it works for them. Uh, Alright, we should be able to stand all about there and say goodbye to an ancient Stegodon. And just watch his. He's got a lot of armor, but we have a lot of arrows, so... And he is a big motherfucker. That is dead. Alright, let's... Drop another flame storm about here. If we can get it to wander through these units again. Uh, didn't really, but that's alright. Alright, and since these Temple Guard are facing away from us, let's see if we can get our arrows into their backs. Not particularly efficiently there, so let's move. No, don't move forward, just move across. Alright, now, yeah, how are we going? Yeah, that's better. Now we're doing some damage. Main reason you want to target the Temple Guard is because there's a lot of balance of power in them. And they were standing there, not using their shields, so that's their own fault. They're not, not going to use their shields to protect them. We're going to kill them. That sounds fair, doesn't it? From my perspective, it seems fair. 
Oh, those four are out. They've done their duties. Good work, boys. Thank you very much. We're not going for the ones with the gold chevrons on this end, because if we can get more chevrons for our troops, that's good. Again, we fire at the ones that aren't facing their shields towards us. Because when you're not blocking us with your shields, you're getting the crap shot out of you. Yes, you are. Silly sausages. Yeah, that's a good idea. Move into a position where your shields aren't really going to help you anywhere near as much. Still going to help them a little, but you know what? Would have helped them more if they'd stayed on the walls. But now that they are on the walls, they're facing the wrong way, so... These lizardmen really aren't good at this whole defend your settlement thing, are they? Not from uh, a much longer ranged enemy, anyway. Don't get me wrong, on the field of battle, I reckon I would be fucked. They would... They would wreck a... an army like this. Alright, they're not actually managing to do shit there, so... All right, shoot at the javelins instead. Thank you. Uh, you two. What do we have left to shoot at? That. What do they still have? Oh, okay, they've still got some flyers and stuff. I should probably actually go and deal with them. Are these units here? Do that. Now, on this side of things, I think what we'll do is we'll just use some magic to drop some bolts of burning. So that he can earn his keep. Oh, she, sorry, sorry, sorry. She can earn her keep. If we can get ourselves in range of the pterodons and we'll do some damage to them. <clears throat> if we can get them in range of the pterodons, we'll shoot them out of the sky. Oop. Get in range of the... I want to be in their fire arc. Oh yeah, they're f the fireballless ones as well, so they'll probably have a, a decent amount of balance of power associated with them. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to move probably more towards here. About here should do it. We should be able to hit these ones now. Oh, and there's some cold ones as well, so... Oh, oh there we go. I was going to aim for the cold ones next, and then probably the... Lord Person they've got in there. Lord Person Hero thing. Mm. Oh, that's some cold coffee. Now, chevrons aren't really super important for your units, but at the same time, I like to have them. Alright, let's... Lay this hovel low. Let's occupy it. Execution. Mm. Oh, okay, cool. I'm very good at... Uh, Laying people low there. Executing them, apparently. Alright, Imric. We've got you, Bowmaster, Skymaster. We've got you, Vol's Armaments. I, do, I am going to give him Dragonheart. 
as well at some stage. Not yet though. Uh, I think what I want to do for the moment is we'll, we'll finish off through here because I want to get the uh, Heart of Flame, I think it is. I don't really need to yet, but it's still a good idea. Right, you can now do that and secure us some influence from him. Uh, replenish, replenish troops! No, I do not want him in an army. And I'm going to pop walls in here at the moment. Because we are not in a safe place. Speak your mind. I'm really hoping that the uh, orcs and goblin orcs, the greenskins, are occupied at the moment. <clears throat> really need to get up to a rank four so that we can start trying to get entrepreneurs from our mages. Oh, that's right. There's a frugal. Mm, getting a frugal would be actually very handy. Might have to do that next turn. I didn't realise we had a frugal one. Go through one more. Since I'm looking at it now, I want to go through it now. And try and uh, get that hero. Because otherwise... I... We'll forget. I'll call him the Penny Pincher. Because just, just reducing my uh, upkeep on my army will work very well in my favour. I think. Now I can actually recruit them anywhere, can't I? I can. Perfect. So let's pull him up here. We'll call him, change his name, uh, the Penny Pincher. I'll we'll just call him Penny Pinch. Imgur Penny Pincher. Uh, that's fine. Actually, what we do actually have... Yeah, we'll give him these because our emo don't actually need them. Because he's off scouting for me instead. We're going to get rid of a spearman unit. And pop him in there instead. You're fine. And Kiri and the emo... Alright, so now I can kind of see what's going on there. Dwarves like me a fair bit more now. Welcome, friends of the Still can't get a non-aggression pact with them though. That's fine. Uh, cool. Dragon rider. Let's move our Dragon Rider back. This way. You're still going to go into his army. And that is going to be the end of this episode. Hopefully it's been relatively enjoyable. Uh, there will be more of this to come. I really need to get onto Malice Darkblade as soon as possible. So if we can take out Shattered Cove and Dreadrock, we'll be well on our way. And that's actually rank 5, so... Occupying that would be great, and oh god, he's gonna he's gonna be able to recruit a nasty ass army. So, yeah, need to get onto him ASAP. Anyway, that's been it for this episode. Hope it's been good, and I'll see you in the next one. Please subscribe. I've been Ashen Ninja. Later.